Yeah, indeed. Yeah, neighbors told us that overnight that they heard the rain come down in buckets. And there's more rain in the future, so that means there's really not enough time to shore up that hillside. And that's why four apartment buildings are red tagged. The ocean views remain, but the furniture where people would sit to enjoy them slid down along with much of the hillside. Even retaining walls were no match for the saturated soil. Clayton Robinson is the owner of this blue building. I don't know how much rain we got, but there was a, an open bucket that's this high. Is the water was going over the top. So it had to have been five to seven inches of water just last night right here. Initially, four buildings were yellow tagged, allowing people to get their stuff but not stay inside. So what do you grab? And they say evacuate, you know. They said 24-hour thing. But, you know, we, we grab suitcases, you know. We, we don't know. We just want to be prepared, you know. Yeah, yeah. And I mean, your whole life's in there. But Orange County Fire Authority drone video showed how the hill was still crumbling. The biggest concern is that uh, more land is going to come down. And so that's what we're assessing right now to see what the potential is moving forward. Later in the day, all three yellow tags changed to red. The buildings deemed too unstable to enter. We have a major retaining wall, and it went down and took about half of our yard with it. And we have a pool, and it's the pool that's holding the rest of the yard in. And the fire department right now is emptying the pool to take the pressure off the, off the hill. A strategy that didn't keep Robinson's building safe, nor his income. His building was short-term rentals. We're having to cancel all of our guests, and that's all of our income. All right, and as you see there, looking up on that hillside, that curve that you see, that's that swimming pool that Mr. Robinson was talking about. Now, it was just yesterday that the governor had added Orange County onto the list of counties where there is a declared state of emergency, also the Orange County uh, Board of Supervisors as well. That meant that today it was lucky timing because it was very easy for the Red Cross to be activated to help anyone that might need help that was evacuated from their home. Uh, but from here on end, it's going to be uh, a little less clear what happens, whether or not there will be funding to shore up that hill as soon as they need it. Reporting live in San Clemente, Susan Hirasuna, Fox 11 News.